Welcome to Know Your Doosan. I'm Mark Christopher, and today we're going to look at the latest control from Fanuc that Doosan is implementing to make the user interface much easier to use. The Fanuc Zero I Plus IHMI makes machine tool operation much more user friendly. So right out of the gate, you can see the home screen is different than the traditional legacy NC screens. Today, I'll go through each icon and give you an overview. Let's start with the planning options. The PC operation allows you to connect the machine to a PC via ethernet or an onboard computer. So you can look at any documents or even access your CAD CAM software directly from the machine. Tool Manager is just what it says, but man is it powerful. Here we can upload a picture of the tool, create tool families, set tool life, make notes about the tool, set your tool offsets, and set your tool holder information for reference purposes. Next, you will see your calendar. This function allows you to set up your schedule for the week or for the month. It's easy to set up and you can set reminders, which is a good feature for operators, and you can export the calendar in spreadsheet form and also upload a calendar in the same format. Moving on to the machining figures, the first option is NC operation. There are a lot of operator-friendly functions here that make the day-to-day -day operations of running your machine easier. Alarm messages, work offsets, tool offset page, program folder, macro variables, and one complete page that shows your current feed rate overrides, spindle speed overrides, active M and G codes, and your machine position. This next one is a big one. The easy operation package exclusively from Doosan will make day-to-day -day operations much easier with fewer button menus and a let's get to work attitude. I'm not gonna go through every button that is available here, but I want to highlight the ones that will mean the most to your operators out on the floor, because let's be honest, that's where the money's made. So check this out. You can access your tool management pages, tool load monitoring, M and G code list, and operator login with just one touch. Specific to the mills, you can easily use ATC recovery and your Renishaw measuring cycles. On the lathe, you can use the tool setter guide, your work setup page, and your tool load monitoring application. All of these are improvements that you, the customer, asked for and Doosan delivered. Maintenance Manager is in the improvement figure. In this function, Doosan has set up where you can observe amps, check the level on your batteries, check on the RPMs of your fan motors, maintenance information, and certain inspections that should be completed. This makes for a quick and easy way to observe any possible maintenance issues or inspections that need to be completed. The last figure is the utility figure. First up here is the manual button. This is an ultra cool feature. Here, the manuals specific to your machine or any manuals that you want to add are available. You can search keywords, you can access the contents and move around in the manual via the contents. Jump pages and zoom in and out to make reading easier. The next button in the utility figure is the memo button. The memo pad is super nice to have. You now have the ability to draw right on the screen and even save the drawing if you want. This is a really handy feature that saves the time and effort of finding pen, paper, and somewhere to draw. The setting button is next. This tab reminds me of the settings app on your smartphone. You can change your display settings, general settings, your information center settings, and the general system information settings. I will just highlight a few. In general settings, I can change the time, change the screensaver settings, and the screenshot settings. Over on the system information settings, you can see how much remaining data capacity you have, how much memory usage is left, and you can see what operations were performed with a history of those. Last, you can see the maintenance display button. This is where you can access the legacy NC screens. 
These are the legacy Fanuc pages that look like previous versions of Fanuc controllers. So for accessing things like parameters, keep relays, or doing a full backup, this is where you would do those things as you have on previous controls. On the keyboard itself, you will see below the hard keys, written in white, the legacy hard key functions that become active while in the legacy side of the control. So I know we covered a lot of ground with the new IHMI touchscreen controller. You can clearly see that Doosan and Fanuc have packed this control with versatility and ease of use features. Our customers asked for it and we delivered. I wanna thank you for watching today and keep machining with Doosan.